We're trying every item in the October 2023 Keto Crate right after this. Hey guys, welcome to Smash the Crate, the monthly series where me and my husband this time try every item in the October 2023 Keto Crate. Stick around to the end to see if you were the winner of this crate, but if you weren't, don't worry. You can always click the link in the description box below to get a discount on your very first crate. And you should make your very first crate this crate because there's a lot of good stuff in here. You know what, sweetie? What's that? There's only one savory item. The rest of them are sweet. But you'll it's be not, excited. Not a good thing. You'll be excited because the one savory item uh, is all meat sticks. Oh, yay. I know, right? Okay. And even more. Is no, it, don't it, make it, that it, face. It, don't. It, I was it, I was it, being sincere. Somehow, I feel like, no. I feel like it was something else happening. Um, the flavor is smoky turmeric. Ooh, I know. I don't even know what that Intrigued. means. Intrigued. Yes. It means that it's infused with smoke and turmeric. Yes. Okay. I haven't seen that seasoning in a while. Yeah, because see, you can see, look how like orange oh, yeah, it is. You're right. Yeah, it's very turmeric y. Yes. So. Right, Ooh, this is a, cut this, me this is a risk here. I've yeah. never done this before. It is. So. Anyway, why are you going to cut me one off? Uh, now I'm just going to right. snap right. into a Slim Jim. Okay. So this is my piece it's right here. Beats. Okay, exactly. All right, go. Let's see what turmeric do for me. I can't mm. taste the turmeric. I cannot either. Unless turmeric is very mild and I'm like, they used the peach. But it tastes good. I like it. It's it a tier three. <laughs> it's a meat You're stick, so Richard. <laughs> I know. It's a tier one for me because it's. I a mean, juice. the flavor's good. It's just a, it's a meat stick. I'll never like them. So. Oh my gosh. Mm -hmm. While we're here, let's talk about our tiering system. Yes. So here we rate things from first to worst. So tier one is the best. It gets first mm -hmm. place. It means I love this. It tastes great. I either have or would buy it with my own money. Tier two is, you know what? That was really good. Like I might not buy that. That's not something I would buy, but I would be happy to see that in a keto crate or somewhere else that I received for free. Tier Same three is list. like, eh, I don't hate it. I don't really mm. love it though. Like I would accept it if someone gave it to me for free, but it would kind of be the last thing that I reach for in the back yes. of the drawer and I'm definitely yes. not buying it, right? Tier four is a yuck, icky. I don't like it. I don't like the way it tastes. I would not accept it even if given for free because I don't like that, We're right? Running from that. Yeah, but that's just our taste, right? Yes. So just because we don't like the way something tastes doesn't mean that you might not like it. So for me, meat sticks were always tier three. Always like, okay, if anybody gives me a free, uh, you know, meat stick, I'll take it and I'll put it in a drawer. And most likely he's going to be the one that ends up eating it, right? But I won't like refuse it or throw it away. So. Yes, yes. Okay. I love how your taste buds work. Next. Okay, now we're just automatically into the sweets. <laughs> So now I think we're gonna All right, let's do this. Start. Let's do the bars first. All right. Bars. Right hashtag behind. bars. Okay. So first we have Perfect Keto, the Nola oh, bars. Yay. You remember those from I like a very long them. time ago? I so this is the I white know. chocolate macadamia nut. So honestly, right. there shouldn't be anything about this that we don't like. Um. Ooh, that's pretty. Like it feels like it was just cut in half yes. or like smushed, uh, like. I mean, first of all, it is very chocolate chippy, yes, like white yes, chocolate chippy, that's and that's okay. But like, what Maybe is the size of this? <laughs> what, is, what is with the size of this? I mean, yeah, they definitely. So, oh my god, it is uh, stuck to uh, the paper uh, towel. Sometimes paper towel tastes hell. <laughs> exactly, it is very um, sticky. Okay, let's go. Right, here we go. There are a lot of chips on here. Oh, but it tastes delicious. All I can kind of taste is white chocolate. Okay, give me that back. For the end of it, you can taste some macadamia, but yeah. I mean, when it covered with white chocolate chips at the top mm -hmm. of it, that's all you taste. That that's really good though. I'll go tier one. That's a tier one. I, I mean, love the chew. that chewy texture yeah. and the the sweet flavor of white chocolate. Tier one. So that was great. Yes. Okay, next we'll try. Okay, well, I guess we're switching between the the bars. We're gonna try the Avanola. Ooh, Avanola. So this is the um, is sweet Avanola? almond coconut granola from Avi Foods. I like everything you just said. I know, that's what I said. I like sweet things, I like almonds, I like coconuts. 
I should like this granola. Okay. Let's see. Oh, oh Lord. Oh, do you want me to take, take some of that? <laughs> yeah, it's like a. Yeah, just go hmm. in there. There you go. Sorry there you for go. that. Okay, it's very yellow. Yeah. You know, yeah. like I'm Did not I get sure. Some turmeric on this as well. Exactly. So, so it has like lupini flakes and cassava plant prebiotic fiber. Yes. So like yes. maybe cassava's yellow. I don't know, but I don't know it's more like a gold. It's like a golden. Sweep the floor after this. Oh my gosh! Don't worry, we'll just have Alexander come down here. So okay, let's go. <laughs> I have the granola oh my God. crunch to it. I really like that. I mean, it tastes like Frosted Flakes. And it feels like Frosted Flakes when you eat it. Mm. Mm -hmm. I was thinking more like... Honey Bunches of Oats. There we go. Yeah. Look it's that you. too. D. Look all of the above. You. Yep. Ooh. Tier one. Ooh. Mm. There's like a weird bitterness at the end. Are I'm you gonna, tasting I'm that? I'm going to two just for that. I'll go one and a half because okay. I'm tasting it at the end. Yeah. The very beginning is like, mm -hmm. mm, love it. And don't be wrong, the granola crunch. Yes. Texture's there. Perfect. There is a weird there. bitterness at the end. So, not that enough for me. Great. I mean, like, enough for me to make it so, like, this is a good amount. I got you. Yeah. You give a solid? No, I give a solid two. Okay. I would go 1.5. But it's a little, I would like a little something kind of moist in there with the chains in there. It's a little too It's cheap, granola, right? Richard. It's granola. No, that's a one and a half. So that's good. Let's see what's up. Now we're going to do double bars. Oh. New school crunch oh, bars. Oh, wow. We have both lemon and French toast. I know. I said my husband's going to love one. one I'm going to love the other. So we're going to start. We're going to get the icky one out of the way. You are just cold <laughs> blooded. We're going to get the. I said they feel crispy, so mm, I like where this is going. I'm interested to taste the. Okay, they do not yeah. look anything yeah. like yeah, I thought they would look. Like a, <laughs> it's like a slab of cardboard. It's yeah. like Looks gingerbread. Like a, a really thin keto brick. Yeah, <laughs> like yes, it is very. I mean, this like was like yeah. extruded in a machine and then just cut, cut, yeah. cut. Yeah. It is it is smooth and homogenous mm. and perfect. Like mm. now you're talking. Listen, listen. That's how crispy it is. Like yes. I knew it would snap. Okay, we'll let's see. Okay, but it actually breaks apart right, a lot smoother than I thought based on how tough it is. Exactly. So. Lemon cookie. Let's go. Mm. Mm. Is this a crunch bar or is it a chew bar? I don't it's not know. crunchy. Yeah, it's definitely more chewy than crunchy. That's okay. But I enjoyed it. The lemon is okay. I would have to say they captured it quite perfectly. Yeah, I mean, it tastes like a lemon shortbread, you know? Yes, yes. Hmm. I would go... I'd go tier two and a half. I mean, because, like, lemon's never going to be the thing that I choose. Yes. On flavor alone, probably tier one and a half, right? But just for me personally, it's a tier two and a half. I'll go one and a half, mm -hmm. both personally and professionally. Because that thing good. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me double check. Nope. My husband never takes two bites of something sweet. You know, he likes it. Okay. Next, French toast. Mm, okay, it looks very hue. It's a different mm -hmm. hue, but it's the same. It's actually a little more crackly than, than the first one. So Now i got to get my mind all set for French toast. Okay, we'll see that. Oh, it's a little right. thicker as well. It is. It's like, it's like it was not gone through the same mm. machine, so we'll see. Well, it can't ever be lemon French toast. It's definitely crunchier. Like it's mm -hmm. drier. Yes. I think they nailed the French toast taste. I definitely taste the cinnamon and like the syrup, the maple. Yes. That's okay. I should tier. Oh, flavor is still one and a half to me, but mm -hmm. it's a tier two. I'd give them both 1.5. Yeah. I think this is where it's at. Let's go. Next, we're going to try yeah. Fantastic. Yay. So we've had these before. We really liked, I think it was just a regular was... chocolate flavor. Um, this one is chocolate mint, so, mm. yeah. Okay, that? chocolate mint. Definitely opened it incorrectly. Oh, so. That's okay. All right. One of those tricky boxes. Exactly. <laughs> Why are you I so I was cute? just going where my husband was going. I was fine with it. Wherever my husband goes, mm -hmm. I'm a follow. Yeah. Let's see. Okay, Ooh. like crispy square. Oh, these are crispy looking. Yeah. No joke. Definitely brittly, you know, yeah. like, okay, let's go. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. 
Definitely get chocolate. Mm-hmm. Definitely get mint. Mm-hmm. I don't know. It kind of has like this a is, graham cracker this texture. This is throwing me all over the place. No. Now I'm at a one certain points, and I'm at a three at certain points. Now I'm back at one again. I'm at two and a half. Mm -hmm. I mean, I would say a solid two. The mint oil two. is okay. The chocolate is okay. I think it's the banana that's yes. making me like, I don't well, like I all like those together. I like the initial taste. Then it like melts down. Mm -hmm. Then it picks up again. But like the mint is like a spearmint. It's like a oh, cooling mint. Yes. You know? I don't mind that. Mm -mm. Also, it's more wafery than I thought. It kind of dissolves once mm -hmm. you start to bite into no, exactly. it. I thought it was going to be like snap, you yeah. know? So It was a little bit like ginger snap. Yeah. A little bit like that. It's like a harder cookie. See, I think it was more of like a graham cracker where yeah. like it's crispy, it's crunchy, but then it like, turns like wafery, well, no, that's like what I was powdery. Saying, like it yeah. starts for me, it started as a ginger snap. Then yeah. it crashed me. <laughs> yeah, it, I, mean, it, I mean, literally. So. I was just like, whoa. Hey, okay. Next, this is new. Chipmunk oh. chocolate peanut butter keto bites. Look at Chipmunk. I know this is okay. nice packaging, I Chipmunk. Really fancy too. It is fancy it's packaging. Got a color on paint my walls or something. Yeah, it is like, like navy dark, blue. Dark navy. Did you know the living room upstairs used to be navy blue? What? Yeah, I'm gonna. So I was wondering the shape of these bites, but it, yes, Ooh. they are like smashed. Yes, they are. So here's what this looks like, like to me. Donuts without the circle. Well, it looks like to me, like once again, it was extruded in a log mm -hmm. and then just cut into <sighs> pieces, right? Oh my God, you're genius. Yeah, there's definitely some log. This reminds me of Play-Doh for some reason. And yeah. I know they did not deserve that. But <laughs> like, it's just like, it just reminds me like, you know, like that little machine where like the Play-Doh comes out in a log, you just cut it. So, okay. <laughs> Chocolate peanut butter. Yes. In the log form. Mm. It's giving no bake. Very dense. Very dense. Which I'm sure somebody likes. I like that. Honestly, I do like it as well. So I can't knock it. Thank you. It is chewy. Yeah. It's dense. It's kind of brownie, you know? Like oh, I don't know. undercooked. You know, it's very it just feels very no bake. Oh, you know? I know. That happens to be one of my favorite things. One and a half. I'll probably have to match you and say one and a half as well. Yeah. Probably a little leaning more on the one side than the two side. Yeah. Like one and a half with a lean. I don't know if I would buy that, but I mean, that's, I mean, that's, yeah, I, mean, I love the bite. I, I love the keto I would, bite. I would not buy it. And not, not saying that I'll, maybe it's because I've already had like eight snacks ahead of this, mm -hmm. but I think one of those is like good enough. You're like, oh, that was a lot of chocolate. That's rich, you know, two max. But like, I'm not sitting up there eating a whole package of all eight of them, just like knocking them back. Oh, no. Like, it's very rich. A dab a do ya. Mm -hmm. A little bit. Well, I think what's the serving size? One. One. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Because I was like, one. Closest. That's ridiculous. But now I'm like, oh, maybe not. Mm. Penultimately. No, oh, I know what that means. <laughs> Inside joke. <laughs> that um, mean. something we never had before. Behave gummy bears. We should have started with that. Isn't this right? fancy? And then we started after the dense chocolate. Yeah, no, I know the reason. light fruity. And listen to these fruit flavors. Is that my water? No. I had to cleanse my palate. Ah! The flavors: lychee, passion fruit, Ooh, and raspberry. I don't even know what these words. <laughs> those other two sounded great. I know what those other two are. Okay. Okay, yes. they're all. Oh, I want to see if there were different colors. Oh, okay, I was gonna say. Well, <laughs> Clearly, I was gonna they're say not. They're all the same, so we don't know what to get. Oh my mixed? god, they smell very fruity though. Okay, they so smell very fruity. Three. I mean, yeah, and as you can see, they are all the same color. Yeah. So yeah. They do smell fruity. You okay, let's go. Mm. Oh my god, they're so sour. Mmm, they're mm. so tart. Oh. Oh, I love that. I have to agree. Put mm -hmm. them on nope. There. Okay. You can have you can have two more though. Thank you. These are do this is a one. He's doing too much. I mean, don't get me wrong. No, what? <laughs> the gummy texture is good. That it's like regular, yeah. but the tart sourness of these. I'd say it's a one as well. Mm. Oh, you have to match your one with my one. Whoa. Mm -mm. Those are really good. Oh my gosh. 
I would be really happy. I mean, oh no, mom's not here. But like, she doesn't like gummy fruit Which, anyway. That's also true. But I'm gonna have to wrestle them out of my husband's hands, mm -hmm. okay? Cause like, that is really good. Your little tree though. Mm-mm. Cause I love, I think I, I might like sour more than chocolate. I like chocolate more than fruity, but I like sour more than, I know, who am I? Why? But finally, Richard, ultimately. Okay. There we go. Double dipped on. Oh, yay. And this is milk toffee. So here's the thing. It's like kind of something we've had before, but like, mm -hmm. have we had this version of it? Uh, you don't know. Twist. Well, I think it was milk chocolate, wasn't it? Exactly. We've had milk chocolate. We've had the almond yeah. one. So have we had toffee? toffee? Yeah. I don't know. So we well, always we say, now. I mean, Chalk Zero is definitely saved the best for last territory. So. Okay. so cute. Once again, it comes in the little... Yes, pack of two. I caught it before it hit the ground. Yeah, all right. Speed and reflexes. Okay, yeah, these are huge, like Jordan almonds. So, okay, yes. let's go. Let's roll. Mm. Oh my god. Toffee. Heath bar. Oh yeah. Um, oh yeah. Perfection. Mm. It will appear this deserves a one as well. Mm hmm. Mm. I would say it hit every note that you would like. Because chocolate outer shell, mm -hmm. almond in the middle, crunchy like bits of toffee. It's like you can tell you, it's like almost like a crystallized, you know, like a Heath bar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What is that? Go ahead, girl. I don't know what it is. It's I'm called, working on my adjectives. It's called Heath bar. Yeah. Um, delicious. Tier yeah, one. I would agree. Tier one. That was great. Yummy. This has all been great, but do you know want to see if they like these as much as we like them? That's the winner of this month's keto cream. Yes. That person is. Uh oh. Mm. Do you know what lychee is? I never heard of it. It's a fruit. It's apparently is it a is it a tar fruit? It's from, uh, I'm about to Google it right now because South America. Yeah, because those are good. This is yeah. also that's good enough to where it makes me want to know like. What else? What other flavors do they make? Is this the only thing they make? Like, do they have like a lemon oh, lime, yes. you know, Somebody situation? Run into the internet. I really am because those were delicious. And send me an email at watchoutomketo at gmail.com yes. and the nice folks at Keto Crate will get one of these shipped out to you. Mm. Hey, but if you didn't win, this is the Keto Crate. I mean, for the Chalk Zero. I'm saying. And the Behave Alone. Dips, and the dips, little, the dips. new school thingies, like, Totally worth it. Like and crunchy bar. Meat stick people. This was pretty juicy. Oh, regular. Okay, well, thank you so much for joining us this month, uh, and we'll catch you next month. Of course. Bye. Bye, y'all. These are good. Mm -hmm, good. I'm gonna fold those over. Oh my god, what's that? Richard, Look I'm not right there. Look, it's right there. Look oh, at it. Oh, what is it? Dummy dumb. Uh, I didn't say that. Mm, you good. treat me like I'm a dummy dumb. <gasps> mm, but these are good.